Hi there, this is Muntasim and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create 300 pins in under 15 minutes. I'll be using Letterpin for this process. If you are new to Letterpin, simply sign up for a free account. You will get 50 credits to explore the tool. I already have an account, so I'll just head to the dashboard. Once you are logged in, you'll see a dashboard like this. On the left side, you will see your available credits. If you are on a free plan, you'll see 50 credits here. Next, you'll need to link your Pinterest account, which is required to use the tool. Since I have already linked mine, I cannot show you the process directly, but it's very simple. Here, you will see an option called Add Pinterest account. So when you click on it, it will take you to the Pinterest account page. On the right side, you'll see a button named Add Account. Once you click on it, you will be redirected to Pinterest to log in and grant access. Once you authorize it, you will be taken back to Letter Pin again. Now we will set up the schedule. On the left side, under setting, you will see a page named Schedules. Just click on it. Here you can select your time zone posting time frames and number of pins per day. I already selected time zone America, New York. On the time frames, I selected a start time 8 o'clock to 11 o'clock. You can add multiple time frames. It's max 2. So here, for example, you would say 8 to 11 and then you can select from 14 to 23. The recommend numbers of posts adjust based on your selected time frames. For example, if I select 22, it's get down to 22. If I remove this time frame, you can see it's right now 6. And post per day is set to 4. I'll just stick to it. I just click on save schedule. The settings has been saved successfully. Now head to the generate tab on the left side. This is how the magic happens. Here we have two options. Fetch from URL or upload images directly. I'll be using fetch from URL for this video. Here I have a page. Here I have the title of the post and bunch of images. I'll just copy the link from here. And paste it here. Here I'll click the fetch. Letter pin will grab all the images from the page. If any images is irrelevant, just click on X to remove it. Let's say I give eight images for now. So on the next step. Here we need to put the keyword of the page. This will be used to generate pins, titles and description using AI. I'll just click on generate with AI. Titles and description for all eight pins are generated in seconds. Now we will customize the pins. Here we have three options. We can choose fonts. We can choose the color palettes or the template. I'll just deselect those. And I'll just deselect those. If I want to, if I don't want any templates, I can just select the image only. So all of the images will be posted directly to my Pinterest. Or if I want to keep the text only version, I can select the text only templates. I'll just keep those three for now to generate these pins. I'll go to the next step once I am done with the template. Letter pin will automatically fetch all your boards from Pinterest. 
you can also search for a specific board by name i just have one temp one boards right now so i'll just select it and click on save to draft your pins will be generated and stored in the draft sections so let's get to the drafts all the eight pins that we generated a few seconds ago it's here Now to publish the drafts, we can head to the schedules. Right now we don't have any schedules pins. So to pull all the draft pins to schedule, we just click on draft to schedule. It will pull all the pins from draft and set to the scheduler. You see your first pin schedule with the timestamp in UTC. When this time arrives, the pin will be automatically posted to Pinterest. If you add more drafts later, simply click on drafts to schedule again, then click on shuffle to mix them for better distribution. I demonstrated a lot of options, which is why this took a bit longer. But once you are familiar with the process, you can easily create 100 pins in just two minutes. That's all for today. Feel free to explore the tool. If you run into any problem, leave a comment below. I'll be happy to help. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next one. Bye bye.